putting in time to properly prepare for your job interview can pay off in more ways than one. Interviews are a very important part of this whole process of connecting to a job. And I suppose as a job coach, one of the things that worries me most about interviews is that it's not always the best person that gets the job. It can be the one that they think is the best. And the only way they're going to get that thought is by, by the interview itself. Going in unprepared. If you go in unprepared, you may as well not be there at all. So let's listen to what some experts have to say about preparing for your job interview. There are three or four things that are absolutely important in terms of getting ready for an interview. First one is preparation. Best to go into the interview having fully prepared yourself. You should spend at least four hours in preparation time before an interview. And people will say to me, that seems a long time, John. Why do I need to do that? Well, it's a very cost-effective way of getting a job. Do a lot of research on the company. Get onto the net, the internet, anywhere you can. Find out what the company does, what they make, whatever you're looking at. Go and research it greatly because most probably the biggest question I ask is what do you know about the company? Research is also important. Find out a little bit about the company. You may get a question at the interview, what do you know about Toll Holdings if you're talking to Toll? And if you respond back, well I've never heard of you, it's not likely to get you the job. There are lots of different ways you can research a company. How do you find out if you don't have a computer and can't use the internet? How else can you find out? Well, you can actually ring the company. You can call into the company and pick up brochures. It's easy to find out information on the company. Make sure you're on time. Don't be late. So have a practice run. Know exactly where you're going for the interview. And lastly, and equally importantly, uh, rehearsal. It's very important to get some experience of talking aloud to yourself before you go into an interview. Get confident with what you're going to say. <coughs> Hi, my name's David. No, that's... <coughs> Hi, my name's David. Hi, my name's Sven. No, that's, see, practice makes perfect. If you've spent this time on the uh, job preparation, you may find a job six weeks earlier than you otherwise would have found it. Now, if you're looking for a job that's paying $600 a week, I know that's a lot, but if it is that for the, for the purpose of the equation, that means that you're getting $3,600 in the pocket earlier than you otherwise would. Now, to spend four hours to get that $3,600, it's an hourly rate of $900 of putting in, in the work. Now, who doesn't want to work for $900, hey? So it's well worth uh, while putting in that time. Yep, putting in the research and preparing for a job interview can really pay off. Next, why don't you check out our video on how to best present yourself for a job interview to maximise your chance of winning the job.